Like this video and subscribe right now or this spider will be in your bed tonight. So today we're going to be going through the 5 scariest fan encounters with YouTubers so make sure you watch right to them because there's some YouTubers in here that met some very scary fans just FGTV, Dan TDM, Mr. Beast, and a few others that you definitely don't want to miss on guys it got very crazy but coming straight for this first clip we actually have Face K. Now one day Face K was out in public vlogging with his brother Jarvis and they were just standing on the street when a random kid came up to them asking for a picture but then out of nowhere the kid literally grabbed face k's camera and ran away with it and then started swearing at k as he was running away guys but make sure to keep watching to the end because you won't believe what happens to this fan when face k catches up to him at the end guys it is crazy let's check it out maybe a few chance there or something like that yo, yo what's up mate? Get a picture, oh yeah of course bro my job told that So Face K was chasing this kid for a while when K was literally about to catch up to him the kid dropped the camera and ran into an elevator and the elevator doors actually closed before Face K caught up to him so the fan actually got away but this is definitely a very scary fan encounter guys if this fan actually saw the camera it would have been very crazy because the camera was worth thousands of dollars guys let's check it out. This dude just dropped my camera. What's he doing? What's he doing? What's this kid doing? What's this kid doing? No! No! Bro, he just got away. He just got away. Wait, no. Wait, it's just fell off. Wait, that fell off. Fell off. Oh my god, dude, you broke my tripod. Who the f was that kid? Mate, that was insane. Next up we have Deji also known as Comedy Shorts Gamer. Now Deji has over 10 million subscribers guys, he's a very big YouTuber but one night he was at home with his parents when there was a knock at the door and there were literally 4 to 5 crazy fans all with baseball bats trying to break into Deji's house and trying to get him guys. This is literally unbelievable and they actually had to call the police at the end because of what these fans do here because Deji was hiding upstairs because he had no idea what these fans wanted. But keep on watching because you will not believe what happens after this clip, guys. It's one of the scariest fun encounters a YouTube has ever had. Let's check it out. Shut up, shut up. What do you want? I need to get in. Where's Deji? How did you get in? Where is Deji? How did you get in? Uh, you can call the police. What do you mean? Just call the police. We've got some guys there. Are you serious? Yeah. So after a few minutes these crazy fans were still trying to break into his house and the police were actually on their way at this point but these fans were refusing to leave and then one of these fans actually tried to break down the door so that they could get in and get Deji and this could have ended so badly guys. Deji is very lucky here. Let's check it out. Go, just, I said get the police. What, what's the problem? I should get the police. Why? Oi, I'm going to call the police. Can you, you leave did, now? Can you leave the gates open? No. Can you guys leave? I know you're in there. Can you please leave? I said call the police. What's your problem? Okay, don't shout at me. He slept with my girl. How did they get in? Did you leave the gate? Yeah, wait. Ask him. Is it first? Uh -huh. Why don't you ask? Someone's trying to come into the house, you know? you're telling me that, who is it? Hello? Yeah, I've got some, um, I've got about 10 guys trying to break in. Next up, we have Logan Paul. Now, Logan was at a YouTube event known as VidCon, and at this event, there were literally thousands of fans waiting to meet Logan outside of the building, and he actually wasn't allowed to go outside because there were too many fans, but of course, Logan Paul didn't want to be rude to his fans, so he went outside anyway, and as soon as he does this, literally thousands of fans started chasing him and tried to grab him, guys. Logan knew that he made a huge mistake here, because what happens at the end of this is literally insane, guys. Keep on watching to see what happens right at the end. Let's check it out. You're entering the VidCon wilderness. Oh, my God. My man Here we go, here we go. 
So after these fans started chasing Logan, he was literally surrounded and the only way he could escape was if he went into the water fountain and he thought if he did this, he would be able to get away from the fans. But Logan was very wrong here because literally thousands of his fans followed him into the water fountain and they got wet just to be close to him guys. And because of this, security had to get involved to kick Logan out of the event guys. Keep watching to see how this goes. It is wild. Next up we have Ninja but before we get into it make sure to keep on watching because after this I'm going to show you FGTV's crazy fan encounter it is insane but the fan that I know Ninja was extremely disrespectful towards him and actually ended up going up to him and saying that he thought Tifu was a better Fortnite player than him and this made Ninja extremely mad and he told the fan to go and find Tifu instead and at this point the fan didn't know what to do so he asked Ninja for a hug and this gets extremely awkward very fast guys keep on watching and let's check this out. Hey, hey, who's better, Tifu or you? I don't answer those questions, man. Come on, man. Tifu's a great player, man. I know he's pretty good. Yeah, dude. You'll never know, man. It's Battle Royale. It's weird. It's, I think Tifu is better. Good for you, Tifu. All right. Go find Tifu. All right, can I get a hug, guys? Yes, look at it. And finally, at number one, we have FGTV's crazy fan encounter because basically the dad of FGTV was at this YouTuber event and he met this fan who actually wanted to interview him and whilst he was doing this, FGTV Dodi actually saw a homeless person and FGTV, being the nice guy he is, actually helped this homeless person and gave him tons of money guys. This is honestly a really nice thing to do, keep on watching till the end to see it and this person's reaction is crazy guys. Let's check it out. Trying to find some more Portal Masters to do some vlogs with. And it's what? Kind of looks like somebody up, maybe up. Oh, oh, What's up, everybody? It's the little dance in the hell. Booyah! Went Robert. Welcome. To, what's going on, Rob? I'm having a blast, hanging out with some portal masters here at E3. Oh, sorry, sir. We're getting uh, we're getting asked questions uh, here. This guy wants to know about. Hold you know, on. Excuse me, sir. Sir, come here. So you guys saw the fun with FGTV right there, but now FGTV is about to help out a random stranger on the streets guys, this honestly shows how FGTV is a very kind hearted person, this fun encounter is pretty crazy, keep on watching till then to see what happens, and let's check it out. My man Skylander Dan, he's gonna throw down some money, you gotta, here you go sir. Thank you, sir. Oh, give us, give us a wave. God bless you. Hey, yeah. hey. Here it is. That's how we do things. It's about giving back to people, right? That's right. Say, Skylanders rocks. Skylanders rock. Man, boy, you heard it here first. <laughs> hey, boy, what's up? <laughs> there it is. Thank you, sir. All right, man. Skylander dad Thank making you. friends all making over. Friends up in here. Except for that dude, you owe me. No. But if you're watching right now, then thank you all so much. There's two videos on the screen right now, choose one of them, click the only guys most prefer, continue watching videos on the channel and I'll see you all in my next video. Have a great day.